So, we just got a new video from Cartoon Network, which is more or less a huge recap of the show thus far. Fight for life on the planet Earth. Defend all human beings, even the ones you don't understand. Believe in love that is out of anyone's control. And then risk everything for it. That video also had clips from the new upcoming episodes for Season 5, including this shot of yellow, blue, and white diamond's hands. This pretty much confirms that the light weapon we saw earlier in the show was caused by all the diamonds using their powers together. We also hear Steven talk about his mother's involvement in the shattering of Pink Diamond. Everyone said they saw Rose Court shatter Pink Diamond with a sword. I saw it with my own eye. But Mom's sword can't shatter a gem. It can cut through a gem's physical form in an instant, destroying the body, but never the gem. So how did she do it? I really like how they, like many theorists, point out how Rose's sword cannot shatter a gem. So it seems like the Kooniverse is officially leading us to believe that it was not Rose who shattered Pink Diamond. But if not Rose, then who? In previous episodes where we see the diamonds, we know that the diamonds are always closely accompanied by a pearl. And in the scenes featuring Pink Diamond in this new video, we never see Pink Pearl, even in shots where she should be by her side. Now, that could mean that Pink didn't have a pearl, but in the episode The Trial, Zirkin asked the diamonds where her pearl was during the attack, meaning that Pink likely did have one. So, where was that pearl when her diamond needed her the most? Another interesting part of the new video is how in a lot of flashback scenes, all of the gems seem to be blacked out. Now, this could be seen as a stylistic choice, but I think that this could be a clever way to hide the true identity of who shattered Pink Diamond. We know that gems can alter their physical appearances and essentially shapeshift into all sorts of things. We also know that pearls have the easiest access to the diamonds and could quickly kill their diamond if they had a strong enough reason. Pink Diamond is impatient, selfish, and a bit cruel, so her pearl may have been abused by her and saw an opportunity to solve her problem by killing her. And what better way to do it than to shapeshift as the perfect scapegoat, Rose Quartz. So, this could be why all the faces are blacked out in the new video, because just having Rose's face blacked out would raise a lot of suspicion. So, I believe that Pink Pearl betrayed her diamond to exact some sort of revenge and then blamed it on the known enemy at the time. What do you all think of this theory? Did Pink Pearl shatter her former diamond? Let me hear what you all think in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching, if you were like or subscribe I would certainly appreciate it, and I'll see y'all in the next one.